Lansana Kuyate was born to make music. I don't play for audience. I play for myself, to make myself happy. He's a master musician from Guinea, Africa, whose family has been playing the bala for the better part of the last millennium. I'm too happy to be a part of this, this traditional, and to see we really care about, and to see we, we maintain. The bala is not a part of Kuyate's original tribe. Legend holds it was invented by a king in another tribe, the Sosa tribe. This king deemed it sacred, and anyone who touched it would die. This guy, his instrument, nobody touched. The first person touched this, and his the sacred place, that was my ancestor. According to legend, Kuyate's ancestor was captured by a member of the Sosa tribe. While in captivity, he defied the king's order and played the instrument, and he didn't die. The king was so impressed, he retained the man in his royal court. It's been in the family ever since. Each generation gets trained in the art of the bala. I feel like I'm in what my family. When I play this anywhere I am, it's I'm like I'm what my family. Kuyate began learning the bala at age two. He moved to the United States in 1991 and now wants to share this family talent with the rest of the world.